Hey guys, this is Scope, and we're back with more Let's Play Pokemon Soul Silver. In the last episode, we beat Claire, and now we're in the Dragon's Den, and we're gonna check it out. Try to get our badge, why can't we? And I was just sitting here listening, and man, this music is tight. They just remixed it all to beautifulness. So let's fight this guy here, this Ace Trainer. We'll see how ace you are, buddy. We'll see. Let's show me what you've got. One Pokemon. Dragonair. Oh. I'm sick of Dragonairs. I just had my fill of Dragonairs. And I'm gonna tell you, I didn't like it. Dragon Rage. Who are you? You should be in the gym. Seriously, you should be in the gym. You should go apply. I heard they pay great. Claire's kind of a bitch. She won't give you your badge if you beat her, but... Wow, Sizo actually does uh, pretty good damage to these guys with Metal Claw. I know I already mentioned that, but just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. Does it matter that your stats raise Sizo? She's dead. Uh, Sizo's about to gain a level. That's always cool. Moving on. What do we have over here? An item? Dun 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 dun. Alright, let's check out what it is. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want to go to that. Whatever that is, don't go to it. Items. It was in the little bottle-looking thing. Oh. To be honest, I don't know, because I have so many of each item. I don't know which one's which, but it could be a paralyzed heal or a potion or anything similar to that. Regardless, we continue. What's this? I knew it. I knew it. You know, same thing with that. If you guys really want to know, I'll figure it out, but... You know, they're just healing items and crap. It's not super important. Whereas it was in the beginning of the game. Oh, what do we have here? What do we have here? What do we have here? What do we, can we go around her? I don't want... I do not wish to fight you. Let me see if we can go around her. I mean, I might fight her on my way out off camera, but... No need to waste time as it is. Very cool. That rock by her is an item, though. I know it. Hey, what wild encounters? Corp, corp, mini corp. Oh, Saizo's dying. You know, even if I did kill you, Magikarp, it wouldn't be enough experience to level me up, because you're that pitiful. Let's see. Ha! Did I tell you? Called it. You know, another healing item. Yaw. Yeah. Alright, now we've got a double battle over here. Ah, I guess we have to do it if we want that item, don't we? Well, that's just a dilemma. I guess we're going to have to do it. We are going to have to do it. I don't have a choice, do I? I don't want to fight you, Magikarp. Leave me alone. All right, let's get a potion up in this BZ. Uh, Hyper Potion, yes. Sizo. And then we're going to switch Owl up for some dual low-level action. Out of the items, into the Pokemon, into the Owlsies, switch the Owlsies up to the Topsies. Oh, let's fight these guys. Oh, oh my god. Did you see that? I couldn't even move out of the spot before another freaking Magikarp attacked me. What is this crap? What is this treachery? Madness? This is Sparta. This is the Dragon's Den. All right. Thank you. We actually got off the spot there. Holy hell. Yeah. What are you little kids doing here in the Dragon's Den? How'd you get permission? Did you beat Claire? And then she didn't give you a badge either? Oh, well, certainly not. You didn't beat her with two Dratinis. That's insolent foolery. All right, let's Dragon Claw that. them. that seems to work well. And now, uh, you can use... Oh, and by the way, I said before in a previous episode, I don't remember when. Oh, you missed that that move was Wing Attack. It is actually Air Cutter. Which is slightly better, I think. Uh, yeah. Air Cutter is a good move. Okay, now Al's paralyzed. That's just great. That's just dandy. Oh, and now he's Thundershocked, too. Just team up on Al, why don't you? He's the lowest level. I mean, he's not the lowest level, but... God. All right, let's see if we can... Yes, let's see if we can't kill a Dratini here. 
And very nice. We'd have already won by now, Saizo, if you wouldn't have missed the first time. There we go, 33, Saizo, nice. Oh, he wants to learn to move. Come on, man, I don't know what move it is. Now I'm going to have to all look it up and stuff. It looks like a normal type move. Ah, okay, I'll be right back, guys. And, um, yeah, I'm going to check out what that move is. Hold on a second. Oh, okay, I'm back, and it's Razor Wind, so we're going to skip out. Razor Wind is actually, it's, it's a powerful move in itself, except, oh, damn it. Except, oh, there we go. Except for the fact that it takes two turns to do, so it's not really worth it. Two turn moves should at least be a hundred strength or more. Like, uh, for example, Hyper Beam or, you know, Sky Attack, just shit like that. Alright, and we beat these twins. This item better be worth it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, what is this? Oh, another potion item? Crap. Okay, it looks like... Uh, increases your PP by four... Oh, it increases all f PP of all four of your moves, so... I guess that would be considered a max ether, wouldn't it? Full ether, max ether... Hell, I don't know. It's an ether. Oh, that's the same spot I was encountering Magikarps in. That spot is cursed. Damn you, Magikarp. Damn you. If you guys ever want Magikarp, I know this great spot. They appear every time. Sometimes you don't even have to move. Alright, now, uh, Krabby, use your magic. You guys getting to see Whirlpool for the first time. It's pretty cool. You just wade across the Whirlpool like so. I think it's nice. Oh my god. Can anybody say repel? Oh yeah, and you can find Dratinis here, so that's, you know, they're rare. So by all means, catch one if you want. But first, I implore you to wait to see what's coming. That's it. Repel. Next next chance I get. Oh, another Dratini. They're actually supposed to be quite rare in here, even, even though it's the Dragon's Den, but, uh, hell. You know? Alright. Uh, repel. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, repel. Jeez. Oh, what do we got here? We got a little house. Well, let's head on in, shall we? Maybe our badge is in here. Whoa. Three old guys in a shrine. He's gonna talk to me. Okay. So, basically what's happening here is he's going to ask you a series of five questions about caring and training for your Pokemon. Now, as this game is in Japanese, technically you have no idea what it's, the question is or what even to answer. But there's three options on the bottom screen as you cannot see right now. But there is, trust me. Um, so what I'm going to do is you pretty much just have to look up the answers. Because if you get um, them right in a certain way, you'll get your badge and a special little treat. So, uh, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look up those answers right quick. The, rep or, you know, the order of the answers. And then uh, we'll see where that gets us. We'll see, you know, what that does for us. So, yeah, um, I'll be right back. Alright guys, we're back, and what you're going to want to do is follow this carefully. You're going to want to pick the first option. And for the second question, you're going to want to pick the first option. And for the next question, you're going to want to pick the third, last option. And for the fourth question, you're going to want to pick the first option. And for the final fifth question, you're going to want to pick the second option. And blah blah blah. He's going to say you're a compassionate trainer. And here comes Claire. She's going to say, what? No way, not even I passed that test. Yeah, we know, because you're not a compassionate trainer, and that's why we whooped your ass. Yeah, you're amazed. I know. So he's going to tell her to confer to us the badge. So, 
we get the rising badge, the eighth badge from Johto. We have completed our badges. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweet. Major voice crack. All right. But you're going to notice something odd, which is that... Okay, Claire's going to run out like a little biatch. Um, we didn't get our TM from the gym that we usually get. And, yeah, so that's not cool. No. Oh, that's Professor Elm calling us, by the way, because we got all eight badges. Um, but, yeah, so that call that we just got from Professor Elm is important. I'll talk about that. And then we got to go get our TM from Claire. That's important, too. So both of those we will be taking care of in the next episode. And, yeah, because we're out of time. So I'm saving, and I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Pokemon Soul Silver. Bye-bye now.